Brian DeMambro here with you to take a look at this boxed run of Roycroft periodicals that dates from the early part of the 20th century. The run begins in September of 1918 and as you can see they've got a very pleasing visual contents including advertising uh, inside. For instance, here's an Anheuser-Busch uh, ad right there. The rear covers are uh, all different and are sort of aphorisms and sayings of positive thinking, uh, which um, Albert Hubbard is well known for. He was one of the early uh, positive thinking uh, sort of gurus or proponents who made the way you think uh, brought it to the f sort of to the forefront that it's very important and significant in what happens to you and your impact on the world around you and so on and this periodical embraces that philosophical viewpoint um, that people create their own reality uh, which we are well acquainted with in this present moment the problem is is, is it real or is it not real <laughs> and so as you can see, they're all similar. They all remain sound. They have the original string ties on them. Uh, huh, it's nice. A mottled leather handbag. That's so funny. Hammered copper vase. Yeah, the workshops uh, at the Roycroft um, sort of complex were extensive. There was a book bindery and a metal workshop and colorists working and typographers and publishing and wood craftsmen. It was quite an operation. Look at that great early telephone. The Roycroft shops, East Aurora, New York. Graft is a fool policy. Oh, that's not all these sayings. <laughs> uh, even today, this makes for great reading. Um, you could read these from cover to cover and really enjoy them. Uh, ha, there we go. <laughs> A very Buddhistic saying here, every life is its own excuse for being. Yes, indeed. Oh, look, there we go. Ah, look at this, all this. Oh, this is very interesting. What do we got? This is, oh, a convention. Huh, interesting. And so, this boxed lot is available now online from me, Brian DeMambro.